Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the first official vlog ever. Holy crap, this has been long anticipated. I don't know how long this has been anticipated for, but it's been for a while. I know you guys have been asking me to do vlogs and stuff, and I haven't had the equipment. Now I kind of have the equipment. I have a smashed iPhone 6 to record off of, which will be sufficient for now until I can get better things. But yeah, we're gonna be going like this for now. Um, <laughs> I don't know what to say. I'm on my way to work this morning, so uh, it is 7.53 a.m. right now. I'm a little bit late for work, so I better hurry up and get to work. Uh, otherwise, I'm gonna get my, uh, my damn ass chewed off. Boom, all right guys, I'm at work now, so I have to go do some engineering work, which means I'm gonna be away for about nine hours. So I will see you guys after work, and then uh, I don't know what the hell this, where this vlog's taking us, but I guess we'll just go with the flow of things. Um, so I'll see you guys in a bit. Have, uh, what am I saying, have a good day? What the, the video just started, you damn idiot. All right, well, I'll see you guys later. Alrighty guys, we're back, man. Just got off day of work. We just got off work. It's 5.09 p.m. right now. I uh, just had a nice nine-hour shift at work. Uh, it wasn't so bad. It wasn't too bad. I did a lot of work. Uh, did a fair amount anyway. Uh, got to play a couple games of ping pong this afternoon. Yeah, we have a ping pong table at work. Um, kind of cool. It's a cool atmosphere at work for sure. I should probably not do this Well, I'm driving. It's a terrible idea. Um, interesting day today um shannon had to go to the hospital um she's doing all right though she's doing okay now um she had to go to the hospital and she was there all day um getting stuff checked out uh, but she's doing all right so that's good so it was an interesting day it was a, a bit of a stressful day for sure uh, i'm on my way back home now but first i gotta stop at the store pick up some milk and maybe some other things i'm not sure if shannon tells me to so yeah, picking up some milk. Uh, got milk. We'll have milk in a minute. I'll see you guys when I get to the store. All right, so I was gonna go to to get milk in the uh, in the in the grocery store where I work at. Like, well, not the grocery store where I work at. The grocery store in the city in the city where I work at. But uh, I changed my mind because I realized, all right, the place where I work at is kind of full of hicks. It's full of weird people. Um, it's full of probably people that are related to each other. Um, it's, it's a redneck place in the province that I live. Um, it's greasy. It's messed up. People probably aren't even really aware. Or, or like people probably would think that'd be really freaking weird vlogging in the store. So I'm just going to go to the store in the other, uh, like the other city where uh, I'm staying at right now. Uh, we're there. It's probably a little bit normal. People are, are definitely a lot normal. I mean, the place where I work at, uh, like the area where I'm sitting at, is full of people. Like the whole city is it's either con comprised of these two types of people, or sorry, three types of people. Um, you either drive, it's either full of like weird people that drive lifted trucks, like I mean some shitty lifted trucks, um, or it's a bunch of ricers, people driving Honda Civics with big fart cans on them, making as much noise as possible. A little ridiculous. And oh my God, look, there's some, uh, there's some Amish people. Yeah, there's Amish people that live near where I'm at. It's kind of interesting. I see them reasonably often. So it's kind of, I don't know. I see them on the way to work and on the way uh, off work basically every day. So it's actually kind of cool. I get to see that kind of stuff around here. Uh, what was I saying? Right. There's people that drive fart can rices around town all the time, and they do burnouts in front of my work, or at least attempt to do burnouts in front of my work, which I find is freaking hilarious. I don't know about you guys, but there's probably some of you in the States that run into that sort of crap all the time. So I think it's funny, but besides the point, now there's a third type of person, 
Now this person can't afford either a car or a truck. And these are the greasy people that you see going around town riding in a BMX. So basically those are the three types of people that you see around the place where I work. Which is kind of funny that you can separate it to three types of demographics. But alright, whatever. I guess that, that's just how it is. I guess that's how it is where I'm at. So yeah, this phone is freaking hot. And it hurts my hand. I'm holding it while I'm driving, uh, basically paying attention. Probably not the best idea, but uh, we're gonna have to roll with it, I guess. So, like I said, I'm on my way to the store. Um, it's gonna be about 20 minutes before I get there, get some milk, um, and yeah, I think I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, right, I'm going to the gym later, so you may see some footage of the gym time, maybe anyway. I don't know, I might use it, I may not, it depends, but anyway, find out, um, yeah, see you at the store. Alright, so you can see we're not in, <laughs> we're not in the grocery store, obviously, we're back in my car, and I'm wearing different clothes, different clothes. Well, long story short, what happened is that nothing really interesting happened, uh, after that last recording that I did, so I just, I didn't bother vlogging anything there, so, uh, it's actually... The next day so it's actually june 31st today i believe and i just got off work early because apparently our boss was super happy with our work the last few weeks and <laughs> and he's like yeah you know what uh you can have half the day off today i was like all right well cool all right so i get half the day off it's like 12 in the afternoon uh so i'm like dude like hell yeah i'll take i'll take a day off i don't know about you guys but the, the boss says you can have half the day off and get paid for it that's pretty sick just saying so anyway um basically now i am off work and i need to go work again in my other job um at five o'clock so i'm gonna be going over there very soon i have to stop at shannon's house to pick up a couple things i'm gonna be picking up some video games some old Wii games, actually, because she wanted to play some uh, some old Wii games uh, at um, at my house. She wanted to play some uh, Lynx Crossbow Training, and I think there was something else. So I have to go pick up a bunch of games in the basement. They're all in storage, so I have to go pick those up. So I'll see you guys at our house if no one's home, and uh, we're going to go pick up those games, all right? So I'll see you in a bit. All right, well, before I stop at Shannon's, I got to get some gas because I need some gas. And I still have like an hour to go uh, before I get to my house. But Shannon's house is about five minutes away from here. So let's get some gas, shall we? No doggos. The doggos are quiet. They don't know I'm here. I hear pitter patter. Rico. Rico. You were a little shit last night. You were barking all night. Hello. Hello. Alright, we need to get them games. Uh, that's a good question. Where the hell are these games? They're downstairs somewhere. Oh, he's still fucking smelling my crotch. Get down, dog. Get down, dog. Oh. Terrible. Just terrible. Here we go. What do you want? What do you want? What do you want? Oh, I know. You were little shit last night. You realize that? Barking all night. A little fucktoid. You! <laughs> oh! You gonna do it? <laughs> Chewbacca! <laughs> Oh, you Chewbacca! <laughs> All right, we got. 
We gotta get these damn games right now because I don't have too much time to dick around. I actually have to record something. Hopefully I don't get a copyright strike from that. <laughs> Alright, where the fuck is the damn light? That That's not the right one. That's not the right one. Or is it here? Here. I fucking got it. Alright. So, we gotta look for these damn games. Where are they? Uh, uh, they're over here somewhere. I know that. Holy balls. There's a lot of blue bins here. Oh, man. Uh, near at the bottom, she said. Near at the bottom. And there's like a bunch of them stacked on top of each other. Holy crap. What does it say? Winter coats and scarves. No. What does it say? Closet hangers. Closet hangers. I'm terrible at filming. I apologize. Uh... In closet, it doesn't help. I, I mean, I will. <laughs> oh man, I'm gonna voice crack. Um, I will get better at this. I'm just looking for where the hell I'm supposed to be going here. Where the heck is all this stuff at? All right, let's move this down. Maybe it's under some of this stuff. Uh, what's here? What's in here? Definitely not what I'm looking for. All right, so I think I found it. Well, I guess we'll see it in a minute here, shall we? Is that it? What's in here? Oops. I think it is. Wait, laptop. Oh, we got some. We got some. We got a red dildo in the house. Man, that's one pencil uh, looking, uh, pencil looking dildo. Uh, you know, really soft too. Just saying. <laughs> that's a lightsaber end. It's a Nerf lightsaber end for Wii stuff, which means it should be... It is here. Okay, good. Alright. So that's a bucket. We got everything. And Rico's losing his fucking mind. So, alright. Well, I guess we found what we were looking for, which is good, which means now that I can leave. So, I'm gonna close this, I bring this upstairs, and holy crap, uh, I think there's everything else, is there? Ooh, I should probably put that back up on there, because it's gonna... Uh, hold on a second here. Alrighty, time to go. I will see you guys in the car. This is extremely awkward to hold. I definitely need a selfie stick or something. Fuck. <laughs> see you guys in the car. Or more specifically, I guess I'm gonna say, don't see you in the car. I'll see you guys in my house, since that makes things a little bit easier. There'll be less transitions. So I'll see you guys whenever I get to my house, which should be in a, in a little while. So I'll see you guys in a second. Temporarily here anyway for a few days. Oh, all right. That's close as damn cross door. Alrighty. We are home. Finally. Oh man, it took a while. So many damn idiots on the road. Always. There's always some idiot on the road. All the time. So oh, I guess I gotta eat now. I'm kinda hungry. Or unpack some of my stuff too, because that's kind of important. So I can't leave my stuff laying around. I brought the PS4, which means I'm going to be streaming tonight. Yeah, it is tonight. By the time you guys see this video, it'll be probably past that time, so not like it really matters. But anyway, I'm going to go uh, probably make some food and unpack, and uh, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to eat, though. All right, so I decided what I'm going to have for lunch now. I realized that there were some things in the fridge my parents had which I can make one of my favorite spreads ever to put on crackers or toast or something. Just something that I want to eat I haven't had in a while and I'm like, it's all here. So why the hell don't I make it? <laughs> so if you guys are curious, I have no idea what you guys are seeing here because I'm using the back camera of the iPhone 6 basically. Um, basically I'm making an avocado olive spread that I make. 
It's really good. At least I find it's pretty good. So if you guys want to eat some of this too, you guys can. These are very soft. Hopefully they're not bad. This is so good. <laughs> uh, is there like, there isn't like a best before date. I don't think so, obviously, because fruit's a little bit hard to do that with. Uh, yeah, so I guess we're going to make an avocado spread. So um, I don't know how this is going to work out. Let's keep with this here. Hopefully you guys see it. Yeah, I have no idea if you guys are seeing any of this. I really need some better equipment. I'm gonna assume this is what you guys can see, so we're just, we're just gonna make some of this. You don't screw it. Um, we'll go with it. If it goes in the video, you guys will see it. If you guys don't see it, then whatever, I guess, right? So let's see here. These good? Yeah, they look pretty good. All right, so we got our avocados. We need to cut these up, and basically what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be cutting these up. Putting some mayonnaise, salt and pepper, um, and some olives. It's looking real nice, <laughs> real grim. <laughs> I'm just seeing to smell them. Make sure they don't smell like ass. <laughs> and I'm eating something that's gone rancid, but it's fine. Color looks good. Um, if you guys don't hear from me for the next couple days, I'm probably dead. Damn, avocados killing my ass. So let's uh, cut this and get this son of a bitch out of his. Uh, his skin was skinning the bastard. Yeah, if you guys didn't know how to cut avocado, this is an easy way. Instead of having to peel it, basically you just cut it in half, cut until you reach the core. Um, then you take the core out, and then you literally just spoon it out, kind of like a kiwi, but it comes out way easier than a kiwi. At least I think it does. Whatever. Yeah, there we go. All right. Now we got one more, one more piece. Come on, get in the bowl with your friends. Look like green ball sacks. Not like that's a good thing. Need some green ball sacks. Maybe the Shrek's ball sacks. <laughs> oh my god. Why am I why am I even, you know, thinking of that? Is the question. I'm retarded, so that's fine. That's why you guys are subscribed to me, apparently. Alright, well, that's in there. So let's get that in the compost. And I apologize if the view angle is complete ass, but I'm trying to work with what I got right now. I don't have any of these, any fancy tripod equipment yet. <laughs> Calls it fancy tripod equipment. Whenever it's like the most budget equipment ever, I could probably 3D print a, a case, or like a, not a case, a, an attachment. Why am I using a fork? I'm not paying attention, I'm sorry. I'm making this way more difficult than it has to be. I don't want to use the other one because it's full of green slimy ass. So let's go one. And then maybe a little bit more. That's good. All right. So we got that. That'll go back in the fridge. Uh, we got some salt. Salt here. Should have put in a fair bit, not too much. Enough. And then we got some olives. Let's get our damn olives out. If I can open some of it. Come on. Just trying to rinse this damn mayonnaise off. You know, you don't, you don't really want cum on your, you know, your food. Man, I really gotta stop making sexual jokes. I don't know what's wrong with me today. But apparently sexual jokes is my tone of jokes today. I like to have a whole lot of jokes to begin with. If anything, I'm the joke of the channel. Uh, wait, what else we got? Uh, is that enough? Is that enough olives? Come on. I need more green balls. Okay, good. All right, so you cut these sons of bitches up now. I usually cut them in half, but just cause I like, I kind of like a chunky, you know, piece of olive. I don't really like it really thin. What nice, <laughs> I don't really like it really thin. There we go, another sexual joke. Man, I'm insane. All right. So I'll mash this up and, or mash this up, I'll cut this up. And then probably mash it up after. Well, I mean, I'm going to mash it up. That's what you're supposed to do when you make the spread. So mash it up. Yeah, if you guys like olives and you like avocado, go for it. Um, green olives, I find work better than black olives for this. I find black olives, I mean, it can work, but I personally prefer the green uh, manzilla olives, I think it's called. Manzanilla olives, that's what they're called. All right. So now you get that fork that I threw in the freaking thing. 
because I'm useless. Uh, all right. And you mash the son of a bitch up together. Now that's the fun part because it makes real nasty noises. All right, come on. It sounds so disgusting. All right, come on, mash this son of a bitch up. Now this is like really good on crackers and like bread if you want. Um, good source of fats. You get a decent amount of fats in here because uh, avocados and olives are basically just uh, mainly fats. And you got more fats, which is the mayo. So that's it. I mean, if you want to up your fats in your in your food, these pretty healthy fats. Maybe apart from the mayonnaise, there's probably bad fats in there. I'm not gonna get into the details of fats, but yeah, avocado, olives, you got some good fats in there. So that's what it should look like. Let's see what it tastes like. Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, a little bit more salt. It looks like green ass, but whatever. It's really good. I think, I think it's pretty good. Yeah, that's it. That's the flavor, boys and girls. Boy. Oh my god, I'm getting mess all over my stuff. I'm gonna grab this son of a bitch now. Hey, you can see me now, not my crotch. At least I think that's what you guys were seeing. I don't know what you guys were seeing, but anyways, um, that's it for vlog number one because I guess the rest of the night I'm just gonna be going to work here soon, so not like it really matters. After that, I'm gonna, I have to stream, so I have time to really record anything else. So uh, I would say welcome. Thank you for joining the vlog. This is the first vlog ever, the long anticipated first vlog. Hopefully, it wasn't too boring. I don't know. I definitely need to find more in interesting things to do, but uh. I'm still working a lot and you guys can't see anything, you know, past the work schedule yet. Whenever school starts to roll around, things will definitely be a little bit more interesting. So I want to thank everybody for stopping by the first vlog. I'll see you guys later. Have a good day. I'm out. Peace.